recording. We are uh, playing a new game called Thimbleweed Park. Welcome. This, con this is a super cool uh, adventure point and click adventure game. Carter and I like those. We're yep. starting a brand new story. This is Ron Gilbert, I believe, is the yeah. dude who used to be at like Electronic Arts and all that. But other than that, we don't really know. We don't know much about, about it. Game. We just know there's some history here. Oh. You're looking for a quicker experience because life is exciting. There's too much to do. No. Hard mode. If you're an experienced adventure game and you want to do all the puzzles because there is nothing more exciting in life than playing adventure games. Yes. Hard mode. I feel like we should no, do... No, I want to go puzzles. <laughs> We're going to have puzzles. But it says quicker, whatever that means. No. Well, we don't want to be in a nine-year process. It won't. Carter. It can't be that long of a game. Experienced adventure game where you want all the puzzles. We want all the puzzles. All right. <laughs> Fine. I'm not going through this like. Oh, look at quick. our dude. Oh, he needs a shave. Text above the cursor indicates an interactive object. Objects. Interact with the characters and objects here. Okay. The commands to your characters by selecting verbs. Oh, I like this. Yes. This is old school. Uh, items your character has picked up here. <laughs> I love the art. They're so stupid. A simple <laughs> commands start with a verb and then end with an object and a character. Blah, blah. Complex commands start with a verb and then an object and then end with another object or character. Do you understand that? Yes. Use key and difficult. door. You get it, though. I got it. To review or see advanced interaction tips, select options, then help. Help! That was our tutorial. Good work. Oh, it's my time. I was a kid. This was your time. I didn't know it was set in the 80s. It is! Whoa. Am I supposed to do something? I, um. <laughs> I don't know what that was about. Neither do I. You should move the chat over there. I will, as soon as this finishes this. Sorry, chat. We meant to have you in our faces, and we haven't done it, our due diligence here. We have no idea what you're saying. Thimbleweed Park, population 81. Elevation 14. What I'm hoping is that this is like Twin Peaksy. 80. <laughs> <laughs> I already like this. It's already good. Yeah. <laughs> <coughs> like Indiana Jones letters. Yeah, they're very Indiana Jones. All right. This is pretty in a weird way, isn't it? I'm digging it. Oh, this movement's very old school. Yeah, scrolling, parallax scrolling. I love the art. It's so dumb. Everyone has a big head. Look at this guy. <laughs> big Jay Leno from the side. I fly halfway around the world and an odd note is waiting for me in my hotel room. It says to come to the bridge down by the river. This looks like the place. I could really go for some Wiener Schnitzel after the long walk out here. <laughs> is it German? I can barely hear him. Oh, really? Yeah. We'll fix that. That better? I think so. Okay. Okay. Open, pick up, push. Push, probably. Open. No, oh, probably push the gate. All right, push the gate. Talk to Willie. Willie! I'm supposed to meet somebody down here. Have you seen anyone? Are you the victim of an inferior American social system? <laughs> <laughs> I have to go. I'm sorry. I could not offer you a drink. Oh, before suppose... we do this, let's get the chat up in here. Oh, yes. Chat room up in here. Chat up room. in here. Hold on. There it is. And then click that. Okay, can you see? Yeah. All right. Click Hello, everyone. Other. Click the other one. Okay, which one? OBS. OBS. Oh. You a dingus? Dingus? You're a dingus. You're a dingus, aren't you? Yeah. All right, I'm supposed to meet someone down here. Do we like that? Yes. Get I am to the supposed point. to meet someone down here. Have you seen anyone? Do you have any whiskey? Yep. Are you sure you haven't seen anyone? Sober up, sir. Uh, are you sure? Are you sure you have not seen anyone? <laughs> I'm glad Chuck is dead. Ruined my life. Slap him. Wake up, sir. <laughs> Wake up, sir. Wake up, sir. All right, that's not gonna... Oh. That's... 
Yeah, I'm just gonna say I have to go. Sleep well. Yeah. I have to go. Sleep well. Push him. All right, I'm gonna walk around a little bit. I bet you have to find a drink for him. You know what I realized? Hold on, chat. We're gonna move my camera out of the way. Ah. Because that sucks. Yes. Having to go over the words. All right. All right. Should I walk this way? Yes. Walk to sign. Read. Look at. Look at. Trestle Trail to Thimbleweed Park, 1.7 miles. He's annoying. He has a terrible accent. Walk to light. Okay, I'm there. Look at um, light. <laughs> walk to rock. Oh, I'm in the water. I'm in the water. Uh, look at. I wonder if I can use this rock to put out the light. Why? Why would you do that? I don't know, but we're gonna. Oop, throw it I at had the light. better follow the instructions on the note before wandering into the underbrush. Oh, we need to look at the note. There's a note? Boris, I'm glad you decided this right solution to our problem. There are eyes everywhere, so follow these steps precisely. For your own protection, leave your ID in the hotel room. Go to the river down by the trail. Turn off the light above the trestle sign so I know you have arrived. Meet me at the large entrance to the underground sewers. Make sure you're not followed. Make sure. All right, so... All right. <laughs> so we need to shoot that thing out. Can I pick up? It is a rock. Pick up. It is a rock. I'm already holding it. Oh. Uh, uh, use. Use rock. On light. This is an interesting way of doing this. I like this. Just punch the light. There. I've completed step three of the note. Now for step four. He's obnoxious. Go to the cave entrance, I think. Meet me at the large entrance to the underground sewers. Okay. You think it's over here? Probably. I think it's over there. It's over here in the bushes. In the bushes. There is the sewer. <laughs> I hope I'm going the right way. I don't see you. Oh. Oh. Ah! ah! I did what he said to do. You got punched in the face. Yeah, by, by a, a ghost, ghost or something. Dude. None of us prepared for what we'd find that night. None of us were prepared. <laughs> How much it would change us all. Part two, the body. Wow, that was a quick part one. I'm into this so far. <laughs> I love games like this. Oh, look. Hey, it's Scully and Mulder. Mulder and Scully. Well, that's our guy. They're just gonna... <laughs> so tell me again why you're here. I was assigned to the case by the home office in Albuquerque. There is no home office in Albuquerque. It's neat to know. Look, I like working a case alone. I especially don't need some junior agent messing up my investigation. Especially some junior agent that thinks I don't know there isn't a home office in Albuquerque. So stay out of my way. Take a lot of notes. Sit back and learn. And I'll wrap up this case and we can both get the hell out of here. Your reputation certainly precedes you, Agent Ray. I'll take that as a compliment, Agent Ray. Why is Reyes. he German? It's how it was intended. I'm sure it was. Let's photograph the victim and head into town to talk to the local sheriff. The body is starting to pixelate. <laughs> body starting to... Pixelate. This is going to be a long night. This is awful. All right, it's gonna be fun. Are you kidding me? <laughs> the voice acting is so bad. All right, should I take a picture of the body? Look or pick up body. We'll look at the corpse. Appears to be a male, approximately 40 years old. Looks like he's been in the water for 24 hours. See you can tell by the pixelation Aww. around the nose and he's neck. Let's see here. Who is There's no wallet butt. in his pockets. <laughs> this is bum. But I found a card, possibly a key card from a hotel. Okay. You have to go to the hotel. Look at notebook. Okay, so this is just them. The suit looks tailored. Okay. Uh, should we push the body? <laughs> Pick up the body. Can we open the body? What? Perform an autopsy in the middle of a stream? <laughs> Use the body. That's disgusting. 
<laughs> take a picture of the body. So we're gonna look at. You should take a picture. Um, let's see. Use. Use. Ow. There's no film sure. in the camera. No film in the camera. Oh, do you not have film? Uh, should we use the phone? That is a cell phone. The man. cell phone has no reception. Pick him up! <laughs> Can I pick up the body? I think so. That's the coroner's job. Coroner's job. Pull the body. Better not. Push the I body. I don't want to turn the better not. <laughs> I don't want to turn the body over. Give That's the body. That's the coroner's job. Give. Uh, close the body. <laughs> Can I close the body? I doubt it. Can that you makes talk no sense to the body? All. That makes some no sense at all. Oh, there's a bottle. <gasps> Pick a bottle. Okay, we're gonna look at the bottle. It's an empty whiskey bottle. I'm gonna pick up the bottle. And you're going to drink the bottle. Oh, I wonder if the drunk dude's still there. Nope. He is not. Dang it. It's gonna be one of my. It's gonna be one of the things, though. Oh, maybe I should be looking at the sign. Let's look at the sign. Trestle Trail to Thimbleweed Park, 1.7 miles. My foot has fallen asleep. The bulb's broken. Dude, this chick's great. I freaking love her. All right, so what do you think we gotta do here? Go all the way over to where he got hit in the face. Should I go over there? Yeah. What if I die there? It's a weird noise. There's a bird or something. All right, we're going over to the... What? Wait, you found something old. Go back, look at... Walk to something, something odd. odd. Look at something odd. You didn't click it. It's covered by the underbrush. Uh, but it's an old abandoned chainsaw. Fool me once, shame on me. Fool me twice. Pick it up. Walk to chainsaw <laughs> disappointment. disappointment. Don't look it's at it. It's an old abandoned it chainsaw. Definitely not the murder weapon. No missing body parts. Nice. Okay, can I you use this? Now have a chainsaw. You have nothing to use it on. Just go. It's pretty Just rusty walk. and totally out okay, of chainsaw. Okay, was that the only gas. thing I missed? Definitely I not the murder weapon. Yeah. Well, I gotta wait for to finish no talking. missing body parts. Oh, this is how I get in, though. Chainsaw. Ah! That. Sounds like someone in the sewer is playing the violin. <laughs> <laughs> this is total Ron Gilbert, dude. Uh, that old it. tree is blocking the great entrance. Okay, so we're gonna use this and this. I can't use it until I find some chainsaw gas. No, I never heard of him. Hey, thanks, Fiddly Wel Wel Welver. Hey, I don't know how to get some chainsaw gas. Maybe I can use this. Ooh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Use this. Use that. No thanks. Oh, it's empty. So I don't think you can do anything yet. So do I need to go back? Yes. Walk to drag mark. Oh, let's look at the drag mark. Look at drag mark. Hmm. There are signs of a struggle here. This is clearly a drag mark. <laughs> the victim was obviously knocked out here, then dragged over to the stream. I don't see any blood, so I think he was actually killed in the water. Okay. The trail ends here at this huge rock wall. <laughs> okay. Walk to drag mark. Walk to old tree. All right, so we got to go back and talk to Jimmy, don't we? To Jim Jam. Looking for any oddities here. Some weird noises going on. Yeah. Let's make sure I don't miss it. Can right, you me, switch? Let me talk people? to. Can I talk to you him? Get the top there. Can you do? <gasps> oh. Yes. I need to stay focused and solve this murder so I can do what I need to do. Okay. Okay. So. Huh. Ha! Ha! All right. That's our badge. That's our notebook. That's our. Oh, the film. So we're gonna oh, we pick up. Use or wait, we're gonna give, give film to Lady. I'm glad I figured this out. Like I don't have <laughs> enough to carry already. We're gonna take, uh, let's see. Use. Push, pick up, use. give, talk, yes. use, film. Now 
Take a picture. Now we take a picture. Use camera body. Smile. <laughs> Shouldn't shake Polaroids. Now we can head into town and find the local sheriff. There you go. It's a good photo of the body. I like how the state-of-the-art camera can alter the angle of the shot. <laughs> it's a good photo of the body. Oh, I like oh, how I the state-of-the-art yeah, camera can alter though. the can angle just look of at? the shot. It's a good photo right, right. of the body. Oh, wait, wait. I Switch like how the state-of-the-art camera else. can alter the can angle of the shot. Can I switch between way? Oh, what's this? Oh, this tells me areas of interest. Ooh, that's, that's useful. Good to know. How do I switch between them quickly? Let's find out. Listen to that music. I don't want controller. What retro verbs? Wait a minute. I'm gonna save it here. I don't know, but we're gonna go. We're going back. Open gate. I guess open or use or push. I'll work for that. Wait, what about Jimmy? Don't I want to have them both go? They should go together, shouldn't they? Probably. Oh! Where's what's your bucket? Can you switch again? Switch people. This is interesting. Can I select them both? Oh, wow. Wait, can! Can! Can what? Oh. Can! <laughs> Let's look at it. There's an empty can of Crockford's tuna heads. The good parts. <laughs> Pick it up. He has room. She doesn't. Um, Pick it up. I keep forgetting where my stuff is. Okay. I think I want her because she seems in charge. But how do I get them? I want to select them both. Can I not do that? Like There's not a way to do it. Hmm. It's just annoying that he's just going to stand there. Double click to run. Well, she's running when I... If I just click, she walks, but if I hold down, she runs. Oh. Well, you should do something. <laughs> Whoa. Whoa. Okay, well, shouldn't I get him back? No, it stopped. Go. Go. Should Find I just out. take her? Just go. Okay. Oh. Wait. Ah. Ah. Ah, what the frick? Bird people. Look at Circus Flyer. It's a Circus Flyer with a crazy looking clown on it. I need Pretty him. good makeup, though. I need him for backup. Okay, let's get Pick him. up, pick up, pick up. No, have him pick it oh, up. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Sorry. Goodness. It's a circus flyer with a crazy looking clown on it. <laughs> hmm, pretty good makeup, though. This guy's accent is cracking me up. It's weird. I can't place it. All right. Signals Hello, are very people. strong tonight. What signals? Why are you dressed like a giant pigeon? What do I want to what ask? What signals? Are you sure? Yes. I don't want to know about the pigeons. They're Pigeon Brothers plumbing. All right. What signals? The signals. The signals are very strong tonight. Yes, you already said that. But what signals? <laughs> I'm just screwing with you. Dark night. Aww. Deserted road. Me in a giant pigeon costume? It was too good to pass up. But the signals are strong oh, tonight. Very Park. strong. So far, it's like X Files, ish. Cool. Well, they just look like the X Files characters. You almost ran over a federal agent. That's a felony. This is really odd. Should have. Should I save my name? Uh, my game. <laughs> my game. Sorry. <laughs> That's pretty funny. I don't know why. I think I've had enough of you. I need to find the sheriff and solve a murder. Um. I think I should ask the second one. I think one. you should save your game. This is really odd. Should I save my game? I wouldn't worry about it. The game was expertly designed to have no dead ends or death. Yet still be scary and have a sense of tension. You can feel safe exploring whatever you want. But I'd watch out for the signals. They can be very strong and disrupt the power grid. Okay. <laughs> She's ran over me. Just say I've had enough of you. I mean, I want to know what's... Playing classic <laughs> adventure games has taught me to save often. That was true. Up until Monkey Island. At least with LucasArts style adventures. <laughs> then the designers realized that death and dead ends weren't making the game more enjoyable. It was actually making it less fun. 
I really like this. This is hilarious. That seems like a sensible approach to adventure game design. It is. It just takes a little longer and requires more thought and planning. But it really pays off in the end. Okay. I think I've had enough of you. Should I say you almost ran me over? Sure. You almost ran over a federal agent. That's a felony. I don't think that's Sorry a felony. about that. Their heads are driving like me nuts. I said, the signals are very strong tonight. All right, we get Do you it. know anything about the body by the bridge? Yeah. Do you know anything about the body by the bridge? Why is it whenever a dead body is found, suspicion always falls to the person dressed as a giant bird? Hey, if the beak fits. <laughs> we don't know anything about a dead body, but the signals are strong tonight. Okay. Very strong. Freaking bird person. I think I've had enough of you. I think I've had enough of you. I need to find the sheriff and solve a murder. Nice talking to you, too. Boop. Take a picture. Boop. Talk to what? Big Pigeon, talk to Bigger Pigeon. Should I take a picture? Take a picture. Boop. Use. Beep. Boop. Beep. Boop. Whack. Boop. Okay, we need Jimmy. Oh my gosh, they're so annoying. Squeak. We need Jim Bob over here. No time to talk. We need to figure out the signals. Uh, you two are nuts. You. Which you, one do I do? You. You seemed really determined. I'm sure you'll figure it out. Oh my gosh, click, click, click. he's totally what? freaking Mulder. <laughs> yeah, weird. Beep. Can I click, go click, this click, way? Click. We're gonna walk Squeak. to the man. He's really annoying. Yeah, those noises are... It's locked. Hey! It's locked. He's locked. Boop. It's a plumbing van driven by big pigeons. <laughs> no need. The perps are outside. No need. The perps are outside. Oh, look at this part. I so... really want to place his accent. Beep. Wow. Oh, someone said use the cell phone. Oh. That's smart. You guys are smart. What do we use the cell, cell phone for? Because the signals are strong. Beep. Oh. Squeak. Oh, is that what she's trying to say? I think maybe. Beep. All right, Squeak. use. It's a cell phone. No, we know. The cell phone has no reception. No, no reception. Can you give the cell phone to Beep. the birds? Eek. Beep. Give. Whack. Eek. Beep. She doesn't want it. Click, 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 click. It's a click, she? Click, it's click. a she? Beep. They sound like she's. Oh, they're click, really click, obnoxious. Boom. I hate them. Alright, we're gonna go down the freeway a bit. <laughs> well, what's Running this? Running down the road. Walk to plastic rings. Pick up plastic rings. From a six pack, you're supposed to cut them up before oh, you, tossing them. You need what's his name? Saves wildlife. Oh, oh you have extra room. I have room. extra room. Okay. okay. We need to find something to fill that chainsaw with. There we go. Okay. I I don't understand why they don't won't stay together. Am I doing that wrong? I don't know. Maybe it's just part of the mechanics of the game. Like maybe you do have to be in different places at some point. Should we go to the cemetery? Yes. Well, if I can't die, I may as well just go with myself. True. I'll come get him if I need him. Art, dude. It's great. Can you look at any of them? No. Nope. <laughs> I'm digging this. Yeah, it's pretty great. Uh, I feel like I'm getting a long way from Mulder. Mulder! Like, what am I doing? Just. Oh, we go back. Very odd. There's something to look at. Where? Wait, there was something you could click on. <laughs> You're driving me crazy. Where? Where was it? I don't know. It was back. Where? Okay, well, she's going back. Yeah. Where? I don't know. It's it should hover over wherever it is. It's not distance. Wait, if we hold down tab, it'll show us. Remember? It showed something. If you hold down tab, it'll do it. Okay. But it's not showing it. Okay, here we go. Wait, hold down tab again. You gotta look. Uh, they're up here. See? 
It's really hard to watch you play this game. Flowers left over from a funeral. It's Chuck's final resting place, apparently. So this is where Chuck lives, or... Yeah. The heavy wrought iron gate to the tomb is closed, but I see a switch inside. Can you throw something at it? I don't see a way to open it, but I see a switch inside. I don't see a way to oh open it. Well, then how do we get the switch inside? switch inside? Is there anything that you can chuck? I can't put it in there. <laughs> I kind of love her. Chainsaw. You think? We don't have gas for it yet. But you could maybe switch something with it. <laughs> I'm going to go get Frank. He's going to just keep walking. Let's see what he finds. Ooh. Walk to a bottle. Pick up the bottle. Use it. That doesn't seem to work. Pick up. It's an empty soda bottle. Five cent deposit in Massachusetts, Hawaii, California, Arkansas, Idaho, Wisconsin, Nevada, Georgia, Virginia, Connecticut, Vermont, Maryland, Kansas, North Carolina, Texas, Montana, Tennessee, South Dakota, District of Columbia, Florida. <laughs> that was so annoying. That was kind of great. Should I even worry about taking him there? Because no. if she can't do anything, take him somewhere else. he doesn't have anything. They both need to go to town. Okay, but take him somewhere else. Look around with him. Well, that was town on the other side. But if you go back on the other side of the road, there was more to see. Okay. Let me know if you see anything weird that I'm supposed to pick up. Oh, there's something. No, those are dragonflies. Yeah, let's drive. Oh. Arca Atari, Atari cartridge. cartridge? What? Behind jaggy lines from mucus phlegm games? <laughs> I don't get it. Who'd ever let a game be named that? <laughs> Wait, no, go That's the trail, right? That way. I know. I don't see. I don't see anything. I don't. I don't. I don't see anything up ahead. There's nothing up I ahead. I think the town must be in the other direction. Yeah, we gotta go to town. So we will get him and her out there together because she's up. At, she's out hanging out in the thing. There should be a way to select them both. It's kind of annoying me. I know. All right, let me go get her. Or at least like teleport them to each other. <laughs> yeah, that'd be cool. Whee! Oh, look at her colony. So there's a switch in there, but there's nothing I have for a switch, right? No. Okay. Maybe you wanted all the puzzles, Carter. I, I know. <laughs> Calm down. It was your idea. I'm sorry. It was your terrible idea. Just kidding. I joke. I kid. You kid. And there's a lot of just this. All right. I bet you you'll have to find something in town or something that'll it'll be like a grabby hand. All right. Here we go. Since we can't walk together, there's got to be a way to tie these two together. I really don't know. Look at the controls. I think you should put on retro verbs and classic sentence. I want to know what that is. Oh. They're just ugly text. Oh. Uh. Yeah, there's no... Hmm. I'm going to save again. There's no... Uh, I don't have a way to... I mean, maybe there's a key. Oh. Look, these buttons do things. Oh, look. They're shortcuts, so I could remember what they do. Is there any way to like... Game pause. No. <laughs> Hold on, I'm trying all keys. Try the numbers. Oh, wait. You can switch between the two. Oh, that's it, one and two. One and two, we did it! <laughs> what if it's three? Eventually there's a third and a fourth. Oh, there may be more people. <gasps> That's cool. I bet you you have to stick people in different places. Yeah, you're probably right. Okay, we're gonna go now. Walk to a town. Story moment. Who's watching us? I don't know. <laughs> 
Ooh. Wait up, Eager Beaver. See, they came together to the town. Who's Eager Beaver? You I need to stay beaver. focused and solve this murder so I can do what I need to do. Hey. <laughs> it says Main Street. <laughs> can we can we look at this? Wait, what am, what's my look button? Look at. It's dark, but I can see there's nothing in there. Oh. I think I see it. Pull, look, close. These top three. And then... Oh, okay. They, they correspond to these six... Or these nine keys. Oh, that's nice. That's easy. Okay. Should we look at the key? No good sign. Willie's watch and violin repair shop. Watch Thimbleweed County's most exclusive watch and violin repair. We repair closed. <laughs> Looks like they cleared out in a hurry. I missed the dialogue on the sign. Rent! All right. Uh-oh. It's a sheriff. Howdy. I'm the Thimbleweed Park Sheriff. <laughs> I don't remember calling the Federinos. Eh, that's what you are, feds. Hard to miss the government issue suits. <laughs> Federinos? He's like... Damn Ned straight Flanders we're the feds. The Cut the Mayberry crap. We're talking, taking over this case. Damn straight. Should I do that? Mm -hmm. You know, he plays that serves good pie. I'm telling you, there's some good ans answer answers here. Answers. answers. There's some Dance good answers. Straight. We're the feds. Whoa! Hold your horse, Reno. No <laughs> need to get snippy. <laughs> Looks I like you heard about Flanders our little the sheriff of Reno <laughs> out by the bridge, huh? There is nothing little about murder, sir. <sighs> Ignore him. He's new. No sense in wasting everyone's time, Reno. This cutscene is starting to get long, and it's only going to get longer. Let's find the coroner and uh, get you on your way. Wrestling starts at 8. I hope he's talking about on TV. <laughs> I hope he's talking about on the TV. The coroner is waiting for you in his office. Come see me when you're done. I apologize, Areno, for all the lights being off. We don't stay open as long as you city slick Arenos do at night. <laughs> Even for a murder? Especially for murder. Murder. That makes no sense. There's been a murder. Are we authorized to shoot people of Reno's? <laughs> the inscription says, Pillotronics, the brain of our city. Uh oh. Uh -oh. Company. <gasps> Companies. They're evil. Ooh. What do you suppose this is? It's water a good company. place to get a drink. Let's see. Slurp, 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 sip, 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 slurp, 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 gulp, sip. sip. Glurp. This Good one? Glurp, yeah. <laughs> Blah. <laughs> <laughs> That's so dumb. <laughs> Alright, just. I ah. freaking love it. <sighs> That's so amazing. I love it. It's pretty good. I don't. I guess it doesn't matter who I'm using. It's all about whether I'd rather be a dude or a lady. And the lady's and better. I think the lady's smarter. It says, coroner. Here we go. Howdy who, I'm the Thimbleweed Park <laughs> coroner. Welcome to the future who. It's the same guy. <laughs> oh, these are the latest in crime fighting computers made by Pillowtronics Inc. Face this Tron, is all Finger probably Tron, Blood pretty Tron. advanced, uh, even for the Fedahoos. Oh, Fedahoos. do enlighten us. Ooh, gross feet. I love your sarcastic humor, who, Agent Ray? It's not humor. <laughs> there you go again. We're interested in any help your computers can give us. They look marvelous. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, happy to explain. So happy to explain, who. Marvelous. Yeah, you might want to take notes. <laughs> Already on it. Tell uh, us about the Bloodtron. Bloodtron! Tell us about the Bloodtron 3000. This is the Bloodtron 3000. Put two bloody objects in and it will match the blood type, printing out a report to who. <laughs> <laughs> Tell us about the Fingertron. Uh. Tell us about the Fingertron 3000. Right, Arino, the Fingertron 3000. Insert a fingerprint registry of known criminals and a fingerprint from the murder weapon on fingerprint tape and it will do a match a who. 
<laughs> I love the way this idiot talks. He's the Joe. best. Facetron. Oh, tell us about the Facetron 3000. The Facetron 3000. Dorg, as I like to call it. Let me guess. The Face Areno. <laughs> no, that's what the sheriff calls it. You city folk who crack me up. Just insert two pictures of an individual and it will verify a positive match. Okay. Uh, Aren't you the sheriff of Reno? Beef of Reno. <laughs> Aren't you the sheriff of Reno? <laughs> oh my, no. <laughs> no, 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 who? Well, people say there is some resemblance around the eyes. But we're as different as peas of who's in a pot of who. Plus, the Potahoo. sheriff has that annoying areno he adds to everything. You'll never hear me doing that, a who. Sure. Whatever. Whatever. Fascinating stuff. Fascinating stuff. I think we've heard enough. This is all very impressive, sir. This should cut hours of our investigation. <sighs> Uh, go see the sheriff in his office for a full explanation of the amazing Arrestron 3000. I have some paperwork to do, who? Oh, yeah, uh, almost forgot. Uh, these Tron machines are fully voice activated, so if you need any information, just talk to them. It's I don't like, like we're living the feet in the futuristic year yeah. of 2017. Wait, I want to I hate this town. Let's investigate these Tron machines, then go see the sheriff and get out of here. All right, we're gonna look at the, we're gonna look at the thing. It's a medical skeleton. Please return to Dr. Fred. We're gonna open, open it. Open drawer. It's empty. Open the other drawer. It's empty. There's a fingerprint kit here. Ooh, take that's it. useful. Can I take it? You pick did up. take it. Look. Oh, I did? I don't we'll want drawer. to pick that up. I don't want to pick that up. We go all the way to the right. I don't want to pick that up. Look at you. Chewy Caramel Center. Ugh. You. Awarded to Dr. Mort E. Shun by Sheriff Crook. Mortician, Mortician. get it? Morty Shun, get it? Yeah. Get it. it, get it. Got it. You got it. Um, walk over there and look at. No, look at. Keep going. Walk a little. Is that um, thing on the floor movable at all? Uh, that? No. Oh. Walk to the bookshelf. Lots of medical books there. I can't open that. I can't open that. I can't, 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 I can't open that. I don't want, I don't, 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 I don't want to pick that up. I don't, I don't, I don't. Okay, let's walk to the, let's talk to, how do we talk to, talk to? What's two plus two? Four. Four. <laughs> Ooh, What's... do that one. I want to know if that was right. It probably is. What is the last digit of pi? Oh, this is mean. Like that is mean. <laughs> Cause there is no end. Yeah. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Describe your primary function. The primary function of the face drawn 3000 trademark is to analyze a photograph of a dead body and compare it with an official photographic <laughs> ID to provide a positive identification of the victim. Okay. I'm not doing that anymore. Where uh, do you get the photograph of the dead? Oh Where do no, I... you have the photograph. Where do I get a photograph of you a dead have body? The Should I have her do it? Yes, but look at other things. What kind of official identification do I need from the? I'm going to execute need, a return op code. What? You need to go to the, his hotel room and find his um, ID. Put your unofficial law enforcement camera. Then to use camera with dead body. Dead body. Um, okay, I'm getting out then. Yeah, so we need official identification and then the picture of the body, and then it'll, it'll identify the person. Okay. So we need to find the murder weapon, find print of the murder weapon, get Fingertron report. Find ID in hotel. So we gotta go to the hotel? Take a blood swab from the body. Have we got any of those things yet? We don't know if you this is the a, weapons or any of this. We don't have a blood swab. Wait. Go Should talk at, to these machines? Wait, look, but look at the list again. Get blood, trauma report, pull the reports. In the restaurant. 
So I assume this is in order. So if we go find the murder weapon. Is it's not the chainsaw. You sure we don't already have this murder weapon? There's a fingerprint brush, a small amount of fingerprint powder, but it's missing the fingerprint tape. Do you have a fine fingerprint tape? Great. Okay, she has the exact same thing. I right? know what to do. Put the picture of him into the Facetron and see what happens. Okay, so Facetron. It's a good photo of the body. It's, it's, uh, I like see. how the state-of-the-art camera uh, can see. alter the angle of the shot. Okay. Now what? Uh, talk to it. Talk to the face drawn. Okay. Um. Hmm. So, oh, you know what? I think we can use this. It only works on the room doors in the hotel. You need to go to the hotel. Yeah, but I've put that photo in there now. I know, I think maybe you need the ID as well. So, but it's okay to put it in there. There's yeah. no dead ends, they look, said. look, it has the green. Yeah. Oh, because it's two parts. Yeah. Okay. Let's okay. go. Should Let's we go? Go. Yes. All right, we're, we're going. Follow me, Jimmy. Come, Jim. No, he's not calling me. The coroner. Do I want to go to the sheriff or no? Uh, talk. Yeah, I need to talk to the sheriff. Okay, we're gonna use door. Hello again, <laughs> Agent Arenos. Hopefully, the coroner oh, fills you in on our state-of-the-art Areno computers. Some serious computing power. You're also the coroner, right? I mean, you're the coroner. Is that something about the restaurant? So you know about the pillow factory fire. Arrestron. You, I mean, the coroner said something about the arrestron. Yes, the arrestron. I like how bad his voice work is. It's awful. I kind of like it though. Joe. Joe. Barry. The final link in the chain of a guaranteed Joe, conviction of Reno. Blood. Every detail of Reno analyzed and verified by computer. Moving on. Right. Uh, sorry, Areno. I, I get carried away sometimes. This is the big bad boy Areno you've been hearing about. The Arrestron 3000. Uh, just feed three reports from other Tron machines into this, and it issues a 100% uh, Areno valid So we get the other three, bring them here, we get the now, report. Now, these machines yeah. are the reason we need only one law enforcement officer Areno. Chuck said that computers will soon put us all out of work, allowing for a full life of luxury. Arena. But Chuck is dead. Who is this Chuck we keep? Oh! Uh, Chuck? That one? Yes. Chuck? Sadly, Chuck passed away a few days ago. There was a big service out at the cemetery, Reno. Oh, the entire town showed up, which isn't surprising for the hero of Thimbleweed County. We'll talk more about Chuck later. I need to run Reno and check on a disturbance call out at the old circus. Probably that stupid clown Areno again. <laughs> no, really? He's gonna say clown Looks Areno. Like I'm shocked. To go talk to the shocked. rest of the weirdos that live in this town. We should split up. It will be faster. You cooling your it's heels really in the faster. local diner it's would that. also make things go faster. If we follow agency questioning protocols, this shouldn't take long. Okay. <sighs> Just so don't split up in two areas. Up. I want to yeah, get out of here as fast as possible. People. Agreed. Okay. Uh, look at that wanted poster. I want to open this door. Drawer. Uh, open. That was face. <laughs> Just a bunch of files. There's a fingerprint book here. Oh. Now you have fingerprints. This has fingerprints for everyone in Thimbleweed Park. Just a bunch of files. I can't open that. Use. Um. We interrupt our hostile takeover nonstop music with this important message. Special announcement. Pizza meeting tonight. Find Chet for the secret code. And now back to our special hostile takeover song. Yeah. This is good. No. All right. I guess I want to look at some other things, right? I like when he yeah. looks at things. He's a little more happy. <laughs> She's kind of a pisser. So we're going to look at... 
wanted. Pickle Bill and the Cucumber Gang. <laughs> Pickle Bill and the Cucumber Gang? Yep. Wanted. Huh? A meteor? Huh? Uh? Wanted. Shady Jane and the Sunshine Gang. <laughs> <coughs> All right. It's a police radio. Looks like it's on and ready to use. I can't push that. Why? He says ready to use. I can't use push it. that. Don't push I it. I did. Oh. <laughs> breaker, breaker, one nine. Breaker, blow. breaker. Blow, blow, blow. Daisy, daisy. Attentional units. <laughs> Is this thing on? Is this thing on? Daisy, daisy. Give me your answer, do. <laughs> I'm half crazy. All for the love, love of you. A bicycle built <laughs> for two. That's amazing. Oh my goodness. Breaker one nine, breaker, breaker. Attention all units. Attention all units. See the man. See the woman. Near the diner. Oh. By the old circus. By the old circus. Woman by the old circus? It should be man by the old circus thing. Yeah. Uh, okay. Carter. Just do it. It doesn't matter. With no pants. Are you sure? I have no idea. <laughs> Minding their own business. They're holding a badger. Wasn't there something about a badger? I don't remember anything about the a badger. The cop talking about it. Okay, holding the badger. I'll do pants. Enough screwing around. I've got a case to solve. Wait, try it again. Uh. Uh, attention all units. Attention all units. See the man. See the man. Out by the old circus. Was there a badger thing? I don't know. Holding a badger. Enough screwing around. I've got a case to solve. There must be something. Yeah, that's weird. <sighs> okay, so it's fine. It doesn't have any buttons. Must what? be for incoming calls only. Oh, he, was, he just explained the, the question I was gonna have. All right, so we're gonna split up, right? Is that the deal, or is there more over here? Go look at the cells. Look at this music. The music's awesome. It's closed. I yep. want it to be open. Open it. That doesn't seem to work. Open! Wait, go in it and have her close it. <laughs> okay. I need to stay focused and solve this murder so I can close. do what I need to do. <laughs> Switch to him. Okay. <laughs> he refuses to look any other direction but back. <laughs> I guess I can just open. Aww. <laughs> I know, it's a bummer. Okay. Well, we've seen all we can see in here, right? All right. Oh. Vacuum, vacuum tube. tube. Well, let's look at the vacuum tube. It's a pretty big vacuum tube. <laughs> <laughs> That's all he had to say. All right. All right. You guys have to split up. Uh, open. Do the things. So we're splitting up? To talk to everybody, yeah. What am I going to go see? Who should I go see? The corner? No, we've done no, that. No, go out into the town. Okay, we're going out to the town. Open. Oh. There you go. Hey, Pigeon Brothers. Hey, they're back. Open the door. I can't get over here. Oh, pigeons. Oh, yeah, I can. Should I go this way? What is they doing? <gasps> they're breaking the things. What do they have? No time to talk. We have to fix this slight leak. Okay, what caused the leak? What caused the leak? What caused the leak? Well, the Hydrotron's tube is obviously burned out. We could use a new one. A WC-67? Yeah, we're out of that size. Must have been the signals. Yes, the signals. They're the worst. They're the worst. Get that wrench. I want to pick it up. Pick it up? Where's pick up? Don't touch our Wrenchtron 3000. Only someone like me with the proper training can handle it. Slap that stupid bird. It's a bag full of plumber tools and an odd looking wrench. I want that wrench. I want it. <laughs> I want the I wrench. I want that wrench. Don't touch our Wrenchtron 3000. Okay. Only someone like me with the proper training can handle it. So now you have to go get the proper All right, what does his thing say? Find the murder weapon. Oh my gosh, I don't know where to go. Where? Who has the hotel thing? She does. We interrupt our hostile takeover nonstop music with this important message. The government is not your friend. 
And now back to our special hostile takeover song. I kind of like that lady. I know. All right, we're going to take her because she's yeah. got the hotel key. She needs key. to go to the hotel. Yeah, she has the hotel key, so we're going to the hotel with her. What does her list say? Her notebook. Uh, let's it's find shaking. out. It says, find the murder weapon. So go, find ID for the you're victim. You're going to the hotel. Yeah, let's go to the hotel. I don't. It's this way, right? Yeah. Right. Find it. It's the old and Scully thing. All right, what does this say? Something Tronics. Closed. Forever sorry. Forever sorry. Let's look at that, shall we? Uh, it says, after 34 years of serving the Tri Thimbleweed County area, we had to close our doors. We should have listened to Chuck. Transistors are a dead end path. Tubes are the future. Hmm. Thank you, Tubes our are loyal the customers. That's the savings place. We'll have him go there. Yeah. This is not the hotel. This is some flower flowers. Fancy Nancy flowers. All boarded up. Not even any wilted flowers left inside. But there was flowers at the thing. There's the diner. I know. You need to find the hotel. B Street or Main Street? Uh, Main Street. This is Main Street. Keep going down Main Street. Keep going this way? Yeah. It's, like, it's outskirts. Let's go up here. All right. We need to find the hotel. That's what we're looking for. Blow out puppy sale. Aw. Me and mom went to like a pet store the to pet see all store the puppy adults. Yeah, so Guess cute. no one around here has we any pets. Oh. Ricky's Cakes. I don't want to go in there yet. There's a phone. What if I use the phone? It's out of order. Okay, this is good to know. So if I ever need to call any of these chuckleheads, I'll have a place to get their number. Oh, this is great. This game's gonna be intense. There's I'm so much to it. <laughs> Hair today, gone tomorrow. Oh, I get Nothing it. in there but dust bunnies. Bunnies salon. Is that a Pac-Man? It's, oh, it's a an Pac arcade. Park arcade. Ooh, I kinda wanna go in there. Do it. The doors are locked, and nobody's inside. Break it! Hey, look, a person. Yeah, that's a person. A human person. Should we talk to her? Talk to a lady at the evening of the evening. Should we talk to her? Yes. Excuse me, ma'am. I'm afraid I don't have any spare change, miss. I'm a federal agent. Show some respect, or I'll have you booked for solicitation. <laughs> Sweetie, I'm not a hooker. I'm Lenore Edmund Mulch of the famed Pillowtronics Edmund family, and I'm waiting for my husband and son to arrive on the bus. So I suggest you treat me with a little more respect. We need to come back with the dude. So, should I bring him here now? No. Do you know anything about the body in the river? Do you know anything about the body by the river? Oh, sweetie. Yes, yes, yes. So glad someone <laughs> is finally getting rid of it. But one does hear things, and I do have an inkling of who might be connected to this nasty business. Oh. Tell me who you think is connected. Tell me about the Pillotronics. Tell me who you think is connected. Tell me who you think is connected to the body. Well, I hate to cast aspersions, but I suppose She's it so is shifty. for the good of the town. She is shifting. Tell me what you know. Actually... No. I can't do this. The Edmund reputation is at stake. Spill the beans, trust fund Barbie. Spill the beans, trust fund Barbie. <laughs> Fine, it was my sister Dolores. She abandoned our family and the business to become a... Flooring inspector, pirate? pirate, leather jacket salesman, a hooker like her sister. Pirate? Pirate. Pirate. No, 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 no. It was far worse. She became a video game developer. <laughs> it all started a few years back. Oh my gosh. This is great. She only wanted one thing, to be a game designer for that awful game company, Mucus Phlegm. 
Uncle Chuck wanted something Mucus else for her. Remember we got a no. cartridge, an Atari cartridge. She was too oh. selfish. Only wanted to make stupid adventure games. I've got to get out of this town. Uncle Chuck wants me to program his factory computers, but I just want to design games. I wish I could get a job at a company like Mucus Flem Games. Now the only thing I have to look forward to is my favorite computer magazine. In fact, I should check the mailbox and see if it's arrived yet. Oh, I'm controlling her now. <gasps> yes. Look at her journal. Find the ideal job. Check the mailbox for my computer magazine. Escape from. It's pretty simple. Great. Look at that Billy Idol poster. I'm gonna I look at it. I should check the mailbox for my computer magazine. I will, but I want to look at Billy Idol first. You're a rebel, Billy. I think Revenge of the Jedi was a much better name. Revenge Albert's my hero. Max was the world's first computer generated oh. TV host. Said Someday we'll have one for Lucas real. Film. Oh, look at them sticking it That's to their old bosses. Good. I like it. Ada, you're my role model. Too bad you don't program games, though. It's my handy ASCII chart. Never know when you'll need to decode binary messages, Ask so me. I always practice every day. Printron. This printer ribbon looks all dried out. It won't print anything. Can I take it? Pick Punch it, it. I don't want to pick that up. Look, I don't want to pick that figures. up. It's in here pretty tight. I'd need an LFG1982 tube puller. It's an LFG1982 tube in perfect condition. Look at her action figures. Oh my gosh. Seems like the mail should have arrived by now. She wants me to get it's the, the mail. It's the math trophy I won when I was 12 and attending a summer program at Thomas Bodeman's School of Mathematics. It's made out of solid pewter, except for the infinity symbol, which is pure titanium. I bet you can melt that down later or something. These are part of my action figure collection, including my prized Howard the Duck. Can I pick these up? These are in mint condition. No way I'm going to touch them. These are in mint condition. Oh. No way I'm going to touch them. Seems like the these are in mint condition. No way I'm it's a red gel decoder. What's red gel I decoder? I bet you you can stick stuff in um in the mailbox and then you one of the agents can go and grab it. Oh. This is like a LucasArts game where like the future is weird. <laughs> yeah. Well these guys are all LucasArts guys. I know, but it reminds me of that. I so, like to keep yeah. my bed made. Never know who might walk into my room. Leave. I'll have plenty of time to sleep once I get a job as a game designer. All right, let's go get her mail. <laughs> it's my state-of-the-art Commodore 64 with dual 1541 floppy drives and a blazingly fast 1200 baud modem. Oh my gosh. Go. My state-of-the-art Commodore go 64. Go get the mail. Yeah, they're using it. No, go I'm outside to the mailbox. Games. I want a job at Mucus It says Flem, the so mail was in here. Games. No, that's the computer. I check the mailbox. Oh, it's 1987. There wouldn't be mail. With some new game reviews. <laughs> okay. Go. <laughs> All right. Uh, oh, I'm going to slap you. Should I go into the hall? Uh-oh. What in earth? I don't understand what just happened. Where am I? It's like a Scooby-Doo door. I don't like Scooby-Doo do doors. Go to oh. I still get lost after all these years. Okay. Go down that door. Franklin, you idiot! I'm just trying to, you know, help. Is that yelling? Oh, gag me. I hope my dad and Uncle Chuck aren't fighting again. Is and that since yelling? most of the machinery at the pillow factory is lying fallow, I've come up with this, you know, great plan to repurpose them. We can use them to make, you know, plush toys. Franklin, you idiot! The company is Pillowtronics, not stupid plush toytronics. We make pillows! What do you think <coughs> that would do to our credibility, our reputation? O okay, Chuck, you're right, but um, I was up all night working on the business plan. Maybe uh, you could just, you know, look at it. No, no, no! This it's a like, pillow uh, factory. Marty Are you dad. two fighting again? I'm getting so sick of this. 
Your brother. Take a chill pill. She's yanking her Wait, hair this is like her dad and her uncle? Yeah. Together. Won't you ever stop fighting about it? Nothing you need to worry about, Dolores. Uh, right, Franklin, old brother? Ah, yes. You huh. know, your huh. uncle and I were just, uh, you know, talking business. Why does everyone have a I have some work to town? do. Dolores, can you get my 0.8 millimeter point tip soldering iron? You know, Uncle Chuck, you should use a 2 millimeter flat tip, and you never heat your solder hot enough. <laughs> That's my favorite niece. I can't wait for you to take over the pillow factory. I know you'll keep the Edmund pillow dream alive. I should check the mailbox for my computer magazine. <laughs> so she still wants me to get out of here. Yes, Is leave. there anything to pick up or I'll come back later? Should I come back later? Or should I pick that up? Pick it up. Oh, you took it. The label says it's called Cat 509 Tales. Produced by getdigital.eu. <laughs> uh. It's a box, but it's sealed <laughs> shut. It's a box. It's a box. Is there anything to pick up? I like picking things up. I mean, look at this. Dolores, I'm busy working on my masterpiece. Don't He's a work of art. I'm looking forward to playing chess with him. It's a defunct robot prototype. What's that book on the table? I'd better not touch it. Uncle Chuck gets real angry if I'm empty too nosy ink. about his. It's Why an it empty, empty bottle of homemade printer ribbon ink. I see some black oh, powder ink for her, the her edges, ribbon. and it smells awful. Warning: contents highly flammable. Okay. Hmm. Uncle Chuck is always very touchy about this painting. Wonder why? I don't want to pick that up. I can't open use. that. I don't want to pick oh, that use up. The light switch. Dolores, you know I can't work in the dark. Please turn the lights back on. After you've taken over the pillow factory, you can turn off the lights all you like. All right, he's weird. He is weird. Here? Here? I forget. That one. This one? No. Yes. If it weren't for my monthly computer magazine, no, that again. being here would totally suck. Go out to the downstairs. Over there. Here? Yeah. You sure I don't want to try that door? No, that's where I came out of, isn't it? Yes. There you go. Oh, no way. I want to go back into my room and try that ribbon ink thing. I don't think that's going to do anything. I think it is. I think you have to light it on fire. Why do you have a pie? Okay, watch. Ink. Why do you have a pie? Use ink. I should check the mailbox for my computer. I can't re-ink the ribbon with an empty bottle of printer ink. Oh, there's no ink. Yeah, it's just got some powder in it. What is this? It's a red gel decoder. It's like you put it up to things. I don't. Have you get never it. seen these? No. You what are you put talking it up to about? Like, you put it up to like invisible ink, and you can see it. Oh. It's, it's like a little see-through thing. Oh, okay. All right, so we're still walking here. Do I want to come all the way down here? Or Try that door. There's <gasps> so much in here. Someone smirked. <laughs> so let's use the red. This is Uncle Chuck's paint. Indextron 3000 Library Filing Lookup System. It oh, uses the spewy decimal the system to catalog books. What in the earth? This is good as I can do. Can I use it? Lots of books, but you have to know what you're looking for. Okay. So we don't have anything to look for yet. This is the end of the road. Yes, yeah, so leave. Go get your freaking mail. All right. I'm just getting a sidetracked. <laughs> What's this one? Kitchen! Ooh, why is there blood coming out of the fridge? Uh, can I use it? Use oh, yeah! Your, use your pie! Uh. Ugh. Can I Ooh, pick this stuff up? Of Carefully handling broken glass? If this were a Sierra Online graphic adventure, I'd be dead now. <laughs> but those Mucus Phlegm adventure games treat their players much better. No arbitrary deaths just to extend gameplay. I feel like the sure more they say like that, the more there. we're going to die. I know, I'm really worried. Yeah, I don't believe her. Poopsie. Should we get some poopsie? Yeah! If it weren't for my monthly Batteries. computer magazine, being here would totally suck. Grab everything. I'm trying to see it all. Yes. Now put all of it in the microwave. Should I use something? Should I try using this? No, I think you have to use that on the painting in his room. 
I don't want to do that. It would make it look red. You know the painting in his room that yeah. he's all sensitive about? I think you have to use that, but I think you have to turn off the lights first, so you can't. I'm gonna close this. Should I microwave something? You microwave all of the things you've just picked up. But not all of them. Hot sauce, cheese, and lettuce. Really? Yes. Okay, Carter, that seems bad. Open the microwave! <laughs> oh. Oh. That hit the spot. You just ate it. I didn't... Do it to eat the lettuce. Should I eat it? Yeah. I think I'm supposed to use it. I don't think there's anything to use. Ugh. I'm definitely not hungry for soggy lettuce. I don't feel like the taste for non-trained bark infringing poopsie now. <laughs> I'm not going to drink from something without reading the label. I think I'll just be careful with them. That's good enough for- Flask of Extreme Chili Sauce by Brian H.J. Comes with a warning. You might breathe fire. Maybe I should be careful with this. I should check so, the mailbox for my computer magazine. The, <laughs> the stuff in the ink is flammable and that can make you breathe fire. That's good to know. It's pouring oh, out water. Oh, clean the, clean the lettuce. Oh. Yeah, yeah. So, what do I do? Just grab that. It's a wilting head of lettuce. Use. Ugh. I'm definitely yeah, not up. hungry for so- I'm already carrying it. Uh, it's not gonna work. <laughs> oh, can I open these? There's nothing inside. There's nothing inside. Alright. Oh. There's nothing inside. There's nothing in- There's nothing in- There's nothing inside. There's nothing inside. There's nothing inside. There's nothing inside. That's something. Get it. It's an empty glass. Fill it. The glass is now filled with water. I love this. <laughs> it's fun, and I don't even know what we're doing yet, but I, I love it. Is that a pie? Yeah, I don't Ricky know why there's Lee's a pie. famous thimbleberry pie, hot from the oven. This must be where pies go when they die. It's the math trophy I won when I was 12 and attending a summer Microwave program it. at Thomas Bodeman's School of Mathematics. This? No, the it's other one. It's made out that? of solid yeah. pewter, except for the infinity use. symbol, which is pure titanium. I should check that. I don't want to use it with that. Ah. <laughs> All right, we're getting out of here. We need it's to go get the mail. It's over here. <gasps> The fireplace looks very clean. I get, I love all the things, so I, I want to see all the things. Ooh, a clock. It's already closed. Oh. This clock looks vaguely familiar. Open it. Maybe more highly rendered and smoother pendulum action. <laughs> I should, I don't want to open it. She doesn't want to. I'm controlling you, lady. You don't it's get to closed. decide. Oh, there's a mailbox, finally. Oh, gas! Yeah! I'm picking that up. It's a gas can. Don't oh, get your hopes up, though. Pick it up. There you go. I wonder if it has gas in it, because we're going to need that for the what you call it. Yeah. It's very dry firewood. I already, I al I already uh, got enough firewood. You're going to make a fire! 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 All right. Here we go. Hi there, George. I was just about to check the mail. Great timing. Hey, uh, you you be, still uh, around, uh, Dolores? Thought you'd have left this podunk of a town by now. I was hoping yeah, to get uh, soon. Cliff Clavin on it. I'm looking nope. for a job at a game company in the big city. <laughs> That's not going to make your Uncle Chuck happy. He'll just have to deal with it. What I brings you Chuck all the way out here? I have your special magazine here. Oh, this is I've been past. waiting for that. Thank oh. you. Sure, it's what we dedicated government employees do. Walk all the way out into the country <laughs> to deliver a magazine. <laughs> Look at your magazine. It's our special Mailtron put, 3000 uh, mailbox. Put the gas in the mailbox. Postman comes right. once a day. Because that's a thing. Use it. It's special gas for chainsaws only. It's pretty full. For chainsaws only. Why put am I putting it in the mail? Just do it. Better not. That might start a fire. Why would that be, Carter? You need to give it to the agent somehow, so you have to put it in a place that the agent oh, can find it. Oh, I see this? what you're saying. <laughs> Here. I don't want to pick that up. Read your magazine. Did we get the magazine? I don't want oh, to pick that up. up. All right. It's Bite Me World, the best computer magazine <laughs> Bite ever. Bite me. 
Mucus Flem. Mucus Flem. That's totally Lucasfilm. <laughs> That's great. What a becoming. Makers of games, Highly three cool. lines of haze, and behind jiggy lines, jaggy lines. Just complete and mail in the comprehensive programming test. Apply today. <laughs> Work with people who don't want to get to know you either. <laughs> All right, so we have to. Wow, an ad for a job at Mucus oh. Flem Games, my favorite game company. His name is Doug. I hear they make movies too. And he's digging. Doug this is could digging. be a dream Big come Doug. true. I'm going to apply. Interesting. There's a modem number to call. Okay, we'll do that in a minute. I work at the University Dig of Utah it. with someone Dig named it. Doug in the video game Dig program. It. That's not him. <laughs> digging. 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 Talk to Doug. Hi, Doug. What are you digging? All right, Dolores. I'm just digging stuff in the front green. Mostly holes. But then I buries them again, all neat and tidy. Okay, Doug. You're doing a good job. Ta, Dolores. Ta. Digging in the front green. So should I put this... Digging. Where, where did it go? Digging. The gas can. Digging in the front green with my rusty shovel. Digging. Digging. Ha! Hmm. I'll lick to hook them holes. All right. Digging in the front green. <laughs> this guy's a, he's a hero. He is a hero. Go to the fireplace. Oh, why? Because you can put the wood in there and then start a fire. But why do I want to do that? For fun. It's a log of firewood. Now go up. No, not gas. Go to the ink. Do that. It's an empty use bottle it. of homemade printer ribbon ink. I see some. I can't use the bottle with that. Oh. Why would I go to the hot sauce? Oh. Use. Oh, she ate it. She's gonna breathe fire. <laughs> <laughs> so stupid. See. Right on, dude. Right on. All right. Right on, Wade. Nice warm fire. So she can start fires. Yes. That's glorious. All right. Um. Wonder, wait, let's see if you can do anything with it. The fire? Mm-hmm. What other items do you have? Can I talk to the fire? Nope. <laughs> um, pick up, open the fire. I can't open that. It's way <laughs> too hot to pick up now. I can't push that. I can't pull that. Look at your items, see if you have anything that will work with it. Hmm. You have more items. You know, I'm looking. But if I use the water, it just dumps it out. Should I try it? Sure. No harm, right? Yeah. Yep. Oh, there's ashes. Oh. Can you pick it up? Uh. The fireplace is very sooty and filled with ash. Pick it up. Great. Now I'm carrying around a handful of black soot. Can you use, I already have use a handful of soot. Use okay, the cup so and use. see if you can put it in there. The glass is now full of black fireplace soot. This game's crazy deep. Yeah. I can't believe they're letting me have all these interactions. What am I going to need that for? I don't know! What door is this? I don't remember. Oh. Did the door just ring? Yes. Hold it. There you go. Oh. There's somebody there. There's a person. Hi again, George. It's not like a government employee to make a mistake, but I forgot to deliver this important letter for your Uncle Chuck. He's busy in his workshop and can't be disturbed. I'll take it for him. Okay, Dolores. Here it is. And remember, it's illegal to open someone else's mail. Punishable by a $50,000 fine and or five years in jail. Thanks, George. That's good to know. Okay, back to my vitally important government job. <laughs> vitally important. It's a letter to my Uncle Chuck. Open it. As expected, the post office's poorly programmed auto stamp cancellation machine has failed again. Should I open it? Amateurs. Open. I'd better not open no. it. Uncle She's Chuck would know if it. I read it if the envelope is ripped. She's a good person. She's a nerd. I kind of like her. Was it in here? Go in there. No. No, yes. Go in there. No, that's... My room's it, over here, I but know, didn't but we get something for my room? Should we go do the application? 
Yes, go to the application. Wasn't there something? Wait, what's your journal say? Dial in with modem. modem and fill out the application. Let's go there. What do you think? Yes. Then we'll go talk to. <laughs> you scared Thanks, me. It's JK. It's already. All right, right here. Uh, what do we do? Take the application. Is it this? And go use. No. Uh, I guess this has to go. Wow! An ad for a job at Mucus Flem Games, okay. my favorite game company. Mucus this Flem. could be a dream. I'm dialing the Mucus Flem modem number. This used to be a thing. I know. It's connecting. I mean, you know. I've used this kind of. Thing You've used before. a BBS before. Yeah. I can't believe my computer is connected to Mucus job. Flem. Welcome to the new online Mucus Flem job application program. Just fill out your personal information and answer a she few simple like the... Mucus programming questions. Then print out the application voice. and send it to Mucus Flem. We'll get back to you in exactly five days. Do you hear that too? What is your name? Uh. Dolores Edmund. Should Dolores I do full name? Annie Edmund. Should I? Yes. Thank you. <laughs> what is your address? I don't uh, know. Shoot. I don't. Well, no, they're all the same. But W A W Y W B. Oh, Wisconsin or what? What's what? W Y? Wyoming. Wyoming. What's Where are w -A? we? I thought we were in. Uh... <laughs> Shit, I don't know. I w V. <laughs> What's W V? I don't know. I don't think it's anything. <sighs> Frick. Um. It's not Wyoming, we know that. Washington. Um, yeah, Wisconsin? we just started the game. Yeah, it was just, we're just into it. I mean, we're an hour we're into like an it. Hour. Uh, I'm choosing this. Because it's, think cause WB Washington's because it's near, nothing. but that's Eastern. There, I know they're in Boston-ish. Because the other, because the detective said so earlier. All right. Noted. Next, what's your Noted. programming language of choice? The language you are most proficient in. Uh, oh, um. Assembly. Basic. How about all the above? Basic. Interesting choice. Please answer the following questions about our proprietary mucus programming language. You must get all of the questions right to submit your application. First question. When a game ships, it is encrypted using... I don't know. What?! I don't know. We have to find this we somewhere. We need to look at your your poster. Pause. Pause. It'd be better to find some reference book on mucus before I answer these. Oh. You need to I go. I need to go find a book about you need mucus to go to programming. Your library. This might be over here. This section includes the complete history of mucus phlegm, the pointed history of point and click graphic adventures, and walkthroughs for all mucus phlegm games. I don't need these. I don't. I don't need these. I don't. I don't. I don't need these. I don't. You I don't. I I don't need. I I I don't. I don't need these. Pretty. I I don't. I don't. I I I don't. I I I don't. I don't need these. I I I I I don't. I don't need these. I don't. I I I I don't. I don't need these. Pretty much memorize them all. You need to. Hold on. You gotta look. It's my handy ASCII chart. Never know when you'll need to decode you need binary to ask you for messages, encryption, though. so I always practice what every these day. These are my Anne of Green Gables books. Maybe someday they'll do a TV show. This is my complete set of Nancy Drew mysteries. I'm kind of a fan, I guess. Yeah, if you have any. These are I part got of my it. action figure I guess that might be a five. Maybe, I don't know. Oh my gosh. <laughs> okay, so we go down to the library? Is that where? Yes. Who are you talking to? No one. Don't be on the phone. I'm not on the phone. I need your help. I don't know what you're talking about. Okay. Well. All right. Will the Indexatron do it? Yes. Hmm. It says there's a book on mucus here. Oh. It's in section 3.1. Section 3.1. 2.1. 3.1. Two .2. I think you need to walk into the library. It's on the third floor. It's or up the here. third, yeah. So 
one of the third ones. So k go into the library. Oh, is there further in? Oh, I didn't realize I could go in. Sorry. 3.1, 2.5, 6. It's going to be up. What does that say? It says out of order. <laughs> what? It What's stairs. Out of order? The yeah. stairs. But no. The sign says it's out of order. Burn the sign. Yeah, but that makes no freaking sense. <gasps> oh. oh. Hey, Dad. Hey, Dad. What's wrong with your gut? I don't know. Walk to Chuck the plant? Okay, where's 3-1? 3-1 must be further down this way. No, it's up. Oh, well, okay. So we gotta talk to Dad. Yes. Uh... Talk to Franklin. Uncle Chuck should never have talked to you like that. I like your idea for the pillow factory. Bye, Dad. I love you. Which I one? liked your idea. I liked your idea for the pillow factory. Chuck thought it was a bad idea. He's right. He's never even read it. Uncle Chuck should have never talked to you. Oh, Chuck's the dead one. Yeah, Uncle Chuck is the one who oh. was... You were in his, his study, remember? Uncle Chuck never should have talked to you like that. He's right. My idea was worthless. I'm worthless. Dad, I don't like to see you like this. <laughs> Me neither. Get your you hand out of your confidence. shirt. More confidence. More confidence. Stop telling him... Okay. You need more confidence. And stop letting Napoleon Uncle Chuck complex. push you around. Thanks, Dolores. You're a great daughter. But Chuck knows what is best for the factory. Bye, Dad. Bye, Dad. I love you. Goodbye, Dolores. What? You don't love her too? Jerk. Okay. It's just an old phone. One of the few things in this mansion that's not Tron enhanced. Okay, so this is just the same as that other phone book, right? Yeah. So we don't need this right now? No. Can I pick it up? This is depressing. That's the phone book. Yeah. Uh, walk to Chuck plant. Chucky's been in our family for years. He's a good plant. Why not plush toys? Chucky has been sitting here forever. I don't. That doesn't seem to work. That doesn't seem to work. I can't open that. Go up the stairs. All right. Go that way. You can't go that way. Can't go that way. The stairs should not be out of order. I shouldn't take this out of the library. Maybe you just have to put them into order. Like alphabetical order. So we're still in 2-2. Two, two. Uh, that's stupid. What? How do I get up there? You have to go up the stairs, but they're out of order. What does that mean? I think they might be actually out of order. Yeah, but... Like, out of alphabetical order. I should stick up for myself. The sign says it's out of order. Move the sign. Okay, we're gonna move. Can I move? Pick up. Pick up the sign. No one will miss this out of order sign. There you go. Now go up the stairs. That was the it. The out of order sign is gone, so it's obviously fixed. <laughs> been here for a long time. That's so dumb. That's pretty ah, dumb. I love it though. Makes just question rules. I like it. I love this oh, art. Oh yeah. This art is great. I like him. I love this. I like that one. That's pretty good. Reminds me of your stuff. All right, three five. Or should I be looking at these paintings first? Look at the paintings. That's my great grandfather, Edmund Edmund, who was a great industrialist. That's my great great grandmother, Lady Edwina. <laughs> Edwina. That's my Scottish great 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 grandfather, Edyr the Dragon Slayer. Edyr. Edyr. Okay, here we are. Three, Three one. one. Uh, English binary, art of coding, thimbleweed, the, the toilet, toilet computer. computer. Hold on, art of coding. Is that no, it? No. What was it called? It was something about mucus farts or whatever. They oh called. right, <laughs> it's not mucus farts. What was it? Well, definitely not mucus farts. That's three two. Okay, so we're gonna find this. Code to getting a GF. That's pretty funny. Oh. Right here. Ah. I gotta remember to push this. Okay, can I pick, pick it, it up? up? It's already pushed all the way back. Well, pick it up. Oh, I did. Okay, I guess I didn't. Now read it. <laughs> Should I do anything else over here? Okay. Okay.
Wait, open it up. I think these are all the things Here you need go. to know. Here we go. XOR encryption. No, that's it. We'll have the book know, with us. I'm we'll have it with us. I'm going to take a picture. Oh my gosh. There we go. Okay, it's XOR. We know what to do. Oh, we're going to look at more of this stuff, though. Look at all the pentons. Uh, oops. S. Look, oh. S! Why isn't it working? Oh. That's my caps grandmother, lock. Edith, caps lock and her it. second husband, Charles. I really admire them. I really admire them. That's Uncle Chuck as a young man, with robots on his mind even then. Okay, we're done up here. Now go! I bet you can use the out of order sign somewhere else. Should I keep it? Yeah. Okay, I shouldn't put it back. I think you should use it to change something. I don't know. <laughs> Oops, upstairs. No, wait, is that his study? <gasps> Someone said Kubo got added to Netflix. Oh, uh, what? I just bought that damn thing. <laughs> I really okay. did. I just we bought have, it on Blu-ray. But it's Blu-ray, so I know. it's even nicer. I gotta watch that tonight. You wanna watch that tonight? Yeah. All right. Uh, let's see. Is this way? Yes. Oh, no, I have to go back to my room. Why? To do oh, the yeah, application. To do the application. Where's use? Please answer the following questions about our proprietary mucus programming language. Okay. You must get all of the I'm questions right to submit memory. your application. First question. When a game ships, it is encrypted using... Unbreakable XOR. Yes. Right? Next question. See, when the more, screen scrolls, it moves by... Uh... I saw it this. It moves by eight pixels. Eight. eight. Are you sure? Yes. I'm okay. reading it. <laughs> Next question. What type of files are compiled scripts packed into? Um, MFL. MFL? Next question. What kind of multitasking does Mucus use? Um, Preemptive, cooperative, or systematic? Wait. It, it doesn't say. Okay, I'll check it. Pause application. I must have. It must be on the other. Page. It'd be better to find some reference book on mucus before I answer these. <laughs> yeah, like I the need one. to study the mucus fun. Oh, let me take another picture. Okay. Does this say something about preemptive? Cooperative. Multitasking. That's what it is. Cooperative. Was oh, it the cooperative? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Uh, use. I have to wait for it to dial up. Please answer the following. I love this game. Really I miss good language. adventure games. I you really do. I'm terrible right at them, though, as you can tell. First question: When a game ships, it is encrypted using. Oh, it makes you do this all over again. XOR. Uh, XOR. Next question: When the screen scrolls, it moves by. Eight pixels. Next question. What type of files are compiled scripts packed into? MFL. Next question. What kind of multitasking does Mucus use? Cooperative. Thank you for taking the Mucus Flem oh, programming test. Congratulations. I'll bet that was one of the, the ones that's not in casual mode. Test. What do you bet? Yay! I answered all the Mucus questions correctly. I'm Yay. ready to print out the application. Oh, I oh, love it! I want one! I want one too. That's freaking weird. Oh, wait. <gasps> oh, it you didn't. You don't have ink! Wait. Hmm, I printed my job application, Soot. but the page is blank. Soot. Maybe the printer is out of ink. We need water. Maybe try just try the soot first. It's not gonna do just it. Try it. I can't use the glass wait, of soot. Wait, wait, that... wait, 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 wait. I gotta go get some yeah, water. Go get some water. <laughs> Oh gosh, gosh dang it. I freaking love this. The kitchen was downstairs, right? Yep. Okay. Water's still going. It's a huge uh, waste of water. Use soot. this. I'll just empty this soot out. No! Oh. Maybe oh. fill the... Wait, fill the glass first. Okay, so let's do that. Use... 
The glass is now filled with water. Now, right. you need now to go we to the go fireplace. out to the fireplace, leaving the water on because I don't care. This isn't our house. <laughs> and there's some soot in there, right? Yep. Get it. It's not my job to clean out the fireplace. Pick, pick it up. Oh, yeah, 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 you're right. Pick up. Great. Now I'm carrying around a handful of black soot. Then I go Oops. this. It's black soot from the fireplace. See. So you. Z that would just make a sludgy mess. <laughs> That's what you want to use. Wait, let's try this. See. Yeah. This isn't a water based ink. Not with that smell. And I wouldn't want to print something that could wash Come away. Back. Use the soot with the, um, with the bottle. Okay. The ink bottle is now full oh. of black fireplace soot. Is that good? Now maybe put the ink bottle in the thing? It needs some liquid. Does it? This isn't a water-based ink. Not with that smell. We need some And oil. I wouldn't want to print something that could wash away. Gas work? The ink bottle is now full of black ink. Ma! That was it. <laughs> that was it. Woo! We did this it. petroleum-based ink. Get up here. Oh, you know what's great? Can you switch? I guess I can switch this whole time. No, you can't. No, it's, it's great out. Yeah. All right, my room, right? Mhm. Mm All right, get back go over here. We're gonna go. Use. That should do it. The ribbon is now fully inked. Now you just need to do the computer. Can thing I just again. print again? Use computer. I'm gonna pick up this. Nice. All right. Oh, I think you may have to stick it back in there. Oh, you think? Yeah. There. Yeah. The blank paper is back in the Printron 3000. Okay, use. Yay! Yes. I answered all the mucus questions correctly. Yay! I'm ready to print out the application. This is great. Oh, <laughs> uh, the guys in the chat room knew it was gas ink. Like well done, guys. This part. Idiots. <laughs> oh, look at this. It's giving the address now and everything. Now I just need to stamp the envelope. Dude, this did not happen in 1987, I can promise you that. I want it. I have to stamp the envelope. The envelope the is stamp. addressed. Just needs a stamp. Steal the stamp. I don't think I can. It's a letter to Use my Uncle it. Chuck. As expected, have to give that it to him post first. office's poorly programmed auto stamp cancellation machine has failed again. Amateurs. The stamp thing. It doesn't work in that. Uh, uh, open, push, pull. I'd better not open it. Pull, Uncle maybe. Chuck would know if I read it if the envelope is ripped. I don't want to pull the stamps off. They might rip. So you need water, water? steam, water, steam. Oh yeah, you because you if you steam a uh, envelope, you can open it. That will just make the, the letter soggy. Away. Yeah, so where do I steam it? it? Microwave. Microwave! To the microwave! To the microwave! Wait, I need to get this letter. You may as well get it, right? Yeah, pick it up. Okay. This game. This is nuts. Come on, run, 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 run. I go, can't go, reach go. that. What? She's an idiot. Alright, <laughs> so let's open. Uh, use this. Let's... Put the letter and the water. Water, we're gonna put it's a glass books. filled with water. Use. Um, use. use the water on, and now the letter. Now we use what the letter on the microwave. The well, no, you gotta steam it first. You're not putting the microwave in there or the letter in there. But if you don't, then the water will just disappear. No, watch. Ugh. Close the microwave. There's water right here if we have to get it. So we go use. Okay, now we open it and we go. Where's the letter? Is this my letter? No, this one. Found. So we're gonna take that. We're gonna go use that. Oh, maybe you're right. I am right. <laughs> I hate that you're right. <laughs> now the microwave. I'd have to pick it up first. That is so funny. This is even a thing to do. <laughs> okay, so open. Uh, we look at it. It's a letter to my uncle Chuck. 
The stamps haven't been canceled. Oh, it Boom. did it. Boom. Carter. Now pick up the glass of water. All right. Now we can take these. Put them on that. Use on that, right? Yep. My letter to Mucus Flem is now stamped and ready to mail. Amaze balls. Okay. Oh, wait, read his letter. <gasps> hey, Chuck, baby. What's Chucky, the, baby. What's what the, the beat? He was holding up the toy licensing contract. Your brother Franklin said it was a done deal, so I thought I'd write the big guy himself and get this thing moving forward. My beeping comeback is going to be beeping huge and making ransom dolls will be a printing beeping money. Beep. Beep off, ransom. Uh, you need to give that to your dad. That'll help yes. you. Yes. 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 Right? Correct. He's in uh, uh, upstairs. upstairs. But it's like that so let's do this thing. Hey, Wahoogoo, thanks for the Wahoo sub. Wahoo. Wait. Woogo. Wahoogoo. Woogo. Wahoogo. Woogo. Woogo. I've always called him Wahoogoo, which is kind of pillows. Give him the letter. Right. No, not so that letter. That letter. Yeah. Give? Yep. I better hold on to this. Uh, all right, let's go give it to Uncle Who. Put the out of order sign on your father. <laughs> He is kind of out of order. <laughs> All right, let's go find Grandpa or Uncle Chuckle Nuts, whatever his name is. What's his name? Oh. There's a lot of rooms we haven't been in over there. They all just, just remember they kind of spin you around. All right, use. Whoops, I mean, give this letter. No, this letter. Uncle Chuck, I have something for you. What is it, Dolores? A letter George the Postman just delivered. Oh, I've been expecting this. I hope it's good news. Carter! You hear all about it when you take over the pillow Why did you do that? Dolores, my dear. Gosh dang it, girl. I can't. Alright, what's he doing? Am I supposed to just nothing? Are we done with him? Yes. Now leave! Are we though? I think we need to use the red thing on this painting, but yeah, turn let's off go the find lights. Out. Oh, interesting. Try it, just normal. I don't want to do that. It would make it look red. Because of the light? Well, let's turn off the light again. Dolores! Damn it. You know I can't work in the dark. Please turn the lights back on. I bet you After do have you've to taken use over the, the pillow factory, you can turn to, like, off the lights all you blood. like. Yeah, probably, way. right? Alright, well, we think we're done in here. Do we know what this room I is? I want to know why you have a pie. Feeling my way along. Here we go. Okay. It's a Scooby-Doo thing. It is a Scooby-Doo thing. I still get lost after all these years. Damn it. Ouch! No pinching. Which is the one I haven't been in, the far one? No, you have been in there. No, not here. It's just a Scooby-Doo thing. That's it? I think it's so that you only go down certain doors. Walk into that hall. Oh, See? one was back here. Yep. Now, Why was there a cow? What are we doing now? I don't know. Let's look, look at, at our journal. journal. Yeah. Mail, Mail filled out job yeah. application. All right. So if we look, the, the 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 thing is good to do, right? To always be looking at that journal. Yes. Oh. Why is he digging closer to the house? I don't know. Should I talk to Doug again. Big Doug. Douglas. Hi, Doug. What are you digging? All right, He's Dolores. So I'm just digging stuff in the front green. Mostly holes. Same but story. then I buries them again all the entirety. The front okay, Doug. Green. You're doing a good job. Ta, Dolores. Ta. Ta, dude. Okay, here we Put go. Put the letter in the thing. Where's our letter? Where's the letter? Yar. Wait, pick up. Digging. I can't pick up something I already have. Digging. No. Uh, I guess you use, right? Yeah. How exciting. I hope I get the job. I like that the light goes on whenever you do Five it. days later, around 5 p.m. 
<laughs> I have. Hi, Dolores. Okay, I, have... I have a letter for you. Spider webs oh. all around me. That's pretty good. Good luck. See ya. Diggin. 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 It's a letter from Mucus Phlegm. Did I get the job? Look at it. I think I want to open this in my room, no. just in case it's really bad news. He's digging. Oh, I thought she was going on her own. This room, right? Okay, here we go. It's a letter from Mucus Phlegm. Did I get the job? Mm, now that I'm in my room, I'm still so scared to <sighs> open it. I need to get up my nerve. Come on, Dolores. You can do it. Okay, but if it's a no, that means I'm stuck in Thimbleweed Park and Come have to on, take Dolores. over the pillow factory. She's the worst. Okay, but if it's a yes, what will become uh. of Dad? Stuck here alone with Uncle Chuck. Okay, but... Okay, okay, I'm opening it. <laughs> yes! <laughs> it's a job offer from Mucus Phlegm to be a game programmer. I'm so excited. Can't wait to tell Uncle Chuck. He'll be so proud. But he, first... You should tell your dad. Oh my gosh. What is happening? Oh gosh. Oh gosh. <laughs> This, I can't tell Can if that's the greatest thing that's ever happened. Are you no. allowed to leave? Can no. you click the door or something? I don't think so. Please. <laughs> Maybe. I kind of want to watch this for a second. I think she's just going to keep going. <laughs> what the crap? That was kind of great. Uh, All right. In here? Yep. Got to go talk to Chuck, right? One day I'm gonna build a house and it's gonna have Scooby Doo doors. It's gonna be fantastic. Okay, we're gonna talk to Dolores. I'm Oops. busy working on my masterpiece. Don't touch. Hello, my favorite. Don't niece. touch. Uncle Chuck, I got the job offer. You should be nicer to uh, my father. What do we do? You should be nicer. Just talk about the dad first. You should be nicer to my father. He just wants to help. Franklin is well meaning. I will give you that. But he just doesn't have the same passion and vision for pillows that you and I have. Hmm. hmm. Uncle Chuck! Uncle Chuck! Uncle Chuck! Great news! <laughs> yes, Dolores, what is it, my dear future leader of Pillowtronics? I, uh... Here, read this. He's gonna be very sad. <laughs> His eyes. So shifty. <laughs> You're what?! You're giving up the opportunity to run Pillowtronics to be a... Uh, to be a game programmer? Yes, that's what I've always wanted to do. Not run Pillowtronics. I'm leaving on the first bus out of Thimbleweed Park. Then, Dolores, you are out of my will. You're giving up over 10 million dollars. eyes are all red. That's 20 million in 2017 dollars. Just to pick an arbitrary date in the future. <laughs> you are dead to me. <coughs> Dolores broke this Uncle is charming. Chuck's heart and started programming oh, yeah, I those forgot how we were murder doing simulators. Real life murder is the next logical step for her, sweetie. Stop her before she schemes her way into sweet Uncle Chuck's inheritance. Sure, we'll get right on that. I'm sure you have cats to feed, sweetie. Ciao. 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 I want to see this ad. That Ransom the Clown isn't very popular around here. It says he eats tuna. Oh, yeah, he's a cat. All right. Well, we haven't done anything on our checklist. Let's walk over here. Walk to trash can. I don't want to pick. If by look at, you mean smell, I've already done that. <laughs> Should go to the outskirts? Yeah, yes. There's no path beyond this point. Oh. It just looks like unfinished temp art. There's no path okay, beyond so this point. Okay, so it must mean I have to it. It just looks like unfinished temp Where's art from a cut room. We're gonna go back. We're gonna find it. Wait, should I do this? No one is in there. Is this arcade open yet? It's a door. The doors are locked, and nobody's inside. Okay, sunny salon. Bunnies. Ricky Should Chase. I try to call the hotel? Yes. Wait. 
go to H. These are just names. Is there no hotel? Hannah Weepy Johnson. We have a Hannah Johnson. We do. That's my uh, sister or my uh, brother's kid. Mm -hmm. Harold Vandijik. Vandijik. Okay, well, this is no good because what's the point? There's no hotel with this. we got to find the hotel a different way. Go into Ricky's Cakes. This isn't cakes. Nope, they are not. Talk to Ricky Lee. How do I talk to her? I did. Her. Oh. Hey there, let's go over to the counter where we can talk. Alrighty now. I can't quite put my finger on it, but this place stinks of false advertising. Sorry about that, hun. This used to be Ricky's Cakes, but now we sell vacuum tubes. What an exciting life you lead. What an exciting life you lead. Anyway, I'm Special Agent Ray. I have some questions for you. Oh, pleased to meet you. I'm Ricky Lee, and I'm the proprietor of this little store. What can I do for you, hun? <laughs> I'm looking for a tube for a friend, not me. Since you don't sell tube. cakes. Do we need a tube? Yes. For what? I want the tube. Since we don't sell cakes anymore, what's your store called now? What do you think of Chuck? That's all for now. Let's get it. The tube! I'm looking for a tube. For a friend, not me. We have lots of tubes here. Over 3,000 different makes and models. Do you know the two-letter model identifier? Uh, OMG! It's not gonna be that. Uh, AQ. And what is the make number? Oh my gosh, we're gonna have to find this. Let me see if we have them in stock. She remembered that one chick was talking about <sighs> Bad tubes. news, I'm afraid. They seem to be on back order. Do you have another tube you're looking for? Yeah, we don't know the tubes. And I don't uh, wanna OMG. That's not a two-letter model identifier, hun. Do you know the two-letter model identifier? W. And what is the make number? Let me see if we have them in stock. So these are all good combinations. They seem to be on back order. Do you have another tube you're looking for? We're not going to find this. Ah, We're going to have to get death. hints at it. Thanks. Okay, hon. Just holler if you need me. I don't need you. Is there anything to look at in here? Right. Definitely don't need you. We'll come back to you later. Stinky Pete's is closed. It's Petey's pet emporium. All right, we're gonna go Wait, back. what about the trash bin? Oh, whoops. Filled to the brim with smelly trash. It's already slightly open. I'm not going to open it anymore. Way too smelly for Pick me. Pick it up! <laughs> I can't pull that. All right, now here's the question. I can go this way. Go where, that way. Where does that go? The outskirts. But can we go that way? Oh. I bet that blows out or something. Hello, Reno. Oh. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. It is uh, uh, quite annoying. No, sir. Yes, sir. Oh, they will be taken care of. Yes, sir. Permanently. <gasps> oh, yes, sir. That's ominous. Violently. Uh, yeah. Violently. No, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, wrestling was quite good tonight. <laughs> Goodbye, sir. Hi, Lahanzio. Hello, Lahanzio. Hello. Oh, food and beer. The Quickie Pal. Uh, Movie Rentathon. Meant rent Sewer grate. I can't open that. You need like it a looks thing. pretty dark down there. Do you have anything to I use? I can't see anything there. But it's Looking. pretty stinky. Do you have anything? Um, no. No. Okay, go into the Quickie Pal. Should we go in there? Movie, movie truck. Welcome to Quickie Pal. Can I help you find anything? Hello. Hello. Hey, my gosh. I'm going to get that bear. Can I help repellent. you find anything? Take it. It was a sample from a traveling animal repellent salesman. But I doubt if it actually works. I wouldn't want to find out. Spray yeah, him. man. <laughs> it's a video camera. No, I know. Great. My boss wouldn't want you to touch our camera. Better leave it be. It's a man-eating plant. It's alive. Yeah. Um. It's making horrible noises. I don't want to pick that up. I can't open that. 
Need an I'm s I don't want to pick that up. I don't want to pick that up. I'd play if it were a sure thing. Reading cards. It's an I'm sorry for being a dick. It's an I'm sorry you're feeling like beep card. Jeez. How about Walk that sunset? Walk to dick card? <laughs> it's an I'm sorry for being a dick card. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Do I need to buy one? Let me know if I can help. How rude. Only a dick would buy this card. <laughs> <laughs> ah, that's pretty funny. Uh, All right, so I'm going to talk to him. I just want to like anything. Where? Oh, yeah, he is. All right, let's talk to Leonard. <laughs> Hi there. Lenny. I'm Quickie Pal Leonard. How can I help you? I'm How? Special How can Agent I help Ray. you? Uh, I'm not Holden, if that's what you're thinking. <laughs> Do you know anything about the body by the river? What's your deal, Leonard? These flickering lights are going to drive me insane. I'm going to look around your store. Do you know anything? Do you know anything about the body by the river? No, but I heard the sheriff nearly ralphed when he saw it. The only bods I've seen lately are the righteous babes at the top shelf of the magazine rack. I'm not surprised the only women you see naked are in magazines. Have you seen anyone acting suspiciously around town? Have you seen anyone acting suspiciously around town? Actually, now you mention it, I did see something suspicious a couple of nights ago. I was on the late shift getting ready to close no off the some za, when Willie some the za. Town Bum he walks in. Some za. Was totally Ooh, Billy the Town Willie the it. Town Bum. I'm excited to meet this guy. We, Why we didn't met him, remember? Have we? Well, we didn't, but the, the dude who died did. Why did Willie seem suspicious of you? To you. To you. Why did Willie seem suspicious to oh, you? Oh, right. Yeah. Well, he normally we have to toss him out because the dude smells grody, and he never has any money. Grody. But for the first time in forever, Bro pulls out this wallet and flashes a fat stack of dead presidents. I thought it was kind of bitching when he bought out the liquor cabinet. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> Could, the wallet, Could the wallet you saw have belonged to Willie? <laughs> oh, no way. That wallet was his. I figured he got lucky and found it. Whoa, whoa, whoa. But come to think of it, I'm pretty sure the wallet had some weird red stains on it. At the time, I thought you it was the cherry the mouthwash he drinks, but it could have been blood. Cherry mouthwash? So what's your deal, Leonard? These flickering lights are driving me crazy. Deal, I need Lenny? you to hand over the security tape. How about that? Ooh, yeah. I need you to hand over the security tape. Oh, no can do, broski. We only have one Betamax tape here at the Quickie Pal, and the boss man would freak if I gave it away. If I lose it, my ass is grass. <laughs> so what's your deal, Leonard? These flickering lights? Why do you have a Betamax? Why do you have a Betamax player? We have one sweet, cutting-edge Betamax <laughs> player here. We don't want to be stuck with a piece of obsolete technology when VHS bites the big one. Gotta invest in the superior tech, dude. Nice. Nice. Uh, All right, flicker, flicker. What's your deal, Lenny? So, what's your deal, Leonard? Dude, how do you know my name? It's Are you like it's on your telepathic thing. or and something? And he told her. He said, hey, no, I'm Leonard. You just told me your name, okay, and it's also on your name tag. <laughs> do I? Do you like your job here <laughs> at the Quickie Pal? Heck yeah! I got a freaking sweet deal here with free coffee and minimum wage. Plus, I don't get many customers on the late shift, so I get plenty of time to think. You said to get a lot of time to think. Should, yes. should I be you following this? You said get a lot of time to think. I'm like an abstract thinker, way ahead of the curve, man. My mom says I should be more like my cousin Bernard, who got a scholarship to MIT. But why Leonard be like and that Bernard. dweeb? Bernard well, I could Leonard. be like Chuck Edmund. Oh, tell me about Chuck. Tell me about Chuck. He's my freaking hero, He's man. Dude never went to college. Just started building his machines when he was a kid. That guy made this town rich just by doing what he loved. You seem to really admire Chuck. You seem to really admire Chuck. That's why I dropped out of high school. I don't want to live my life for the man like some peon ah, in a polyester look. cage. No offense. Offense taken. Slap him. These flickering lights. These flickering lights are going to drive me insane. <laughs> yeah, it's a trip, isn't it? 
Oh, they're even better if you get a little toked up and, uh, <laughs> I mean, yes, officer, I'll get those fixed right away. Should I talk to him more? What do you think about the state of the town? I just, just I'm worried. I don't want to miss any hints. Who say this town is over? I mean, pff, not even. We got everything a person could ever need here in the quickie pal for one. All right, goodbye. I'm going to look around your store. Is there anything else to steal? Maps. There aren't any maps left. Sorry, Bear Mace him. Yet. The sheriff came by a bit ago and nabbed all the maps. Didn't even pay for them. Something about immature dominion or something like that. All right, let's try to use it on him. Ugh, smells awful. No, let's use. Ugh. Okay, well, smells then. awful. All right, we're getting out. I want this security camera. I'm here to serve. We have to figure out a way to. My get boss wouldn't want you to touch our camera. 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 My boss would totally not like it. Go to the movie Rentatron. Wait, the movie Rentatron. Okay. All the lights are out. It must be broken. Who? The instructions say insert coupon for movie. Go to the, the vacuum toilet. Tube. Hold on. It's a pretty big vacuum tube. It's stuck. Go to the toilet. It's stuck. Okay. Where's the toilet? Right there. Where? Oh! Oh, I love how simple these are. That's great. I'd rather wait for the hotel bathroom. I can't pull that. Walk into the bathroom. <gasps> scary eyes. They're scary eyes. Ba bear mace! Bear mace? Bear mace! It's called Levo's Bear Repellent. Ugh. Smells awful. I... Look at the eyes. Hold on. It's too dark to see. Do you have a light? Yeah. It's turned. I don't want to pick that up. I can't open that. Use it. Oh. Oh my gosh. They're messing with me. Ugh. For a good time. No Edna. No way am I going to look in there. Good for, for a good time. Here. 3444. Edna. Three, four, Write that four, down. Four. Or take a picture of it. I can't open that. <laughs> oh my gosh, dude. Lock the faucet. The toilet tron. Oh. <laughs> That's great. The toilet paper! Can I use it? Get the toilet paper! No need. I'm very clean. Thank you. Get Ew, pick what do you up. mean pick you're very up. clean? I can't pick it up. Oh. Get up. One sheet is enough. For what? I can only spare, spare a, square. a square. I don't <laughs> want to pick that up. <laughs> I look good. Oh my gosh, she sucks. Look in the, to in the uh, trash bin. It's stuck. Looks like a really big tube. Ugh. They're all... Ugh. They're all used up. Ew. All right, trash well, can. Oh, speck of dust. It's a speck of dust. <laughs> what? <laughs> I have the speck of dust. Look into the trash can. I did. You didn't look into it. I don't know way am I gonna look in there. I can smell it from here. I think I'm good. Do I need anything else in here? What could a pop? Oh, you know what? Uh, use toilet paper. It doesn't help. The mirror is caked with decades of. I don't want to know what. Yeah. Bear mace. <laughs> I didn't look. At, I didn't look at this. Hmm. What do you mean bear mace? It's not gonna do I any good. All right, we're out of the bathroom. For a good time. <laughs> and a For great time place. Call. At McDonald's. You have no idea what I'm saying, dude. Do I don't either. I mean, I don't at all. Uh, Should I go up that B Street? Eight six seven five. Wait, we've been down here. Yep. What? The, then what do we do? Go back. Keep going. Wait, did you go inside the diner? No. Go inside the diner. We have to go soon. What time is it? Yeah, we have to go soon. Who? It's all right. Let's get some info from these people, and then we'll save for next week. All right. Let's talk to Sandy. Or should I look around a little? Look around a little. These what? hot dogs, dude. Turn on the radio. Looks awful. Not like the New York. Welcome to the S&D Diner. 
I'll have one of these hot dogs. Good choice, honey. We're trying to move them out. Let me get that for you. Eat up, hun, while it's still hot. Oh. Oh. Mm. Mm. Um. Ooh, I really don't like how she sounds right now. Oh, my. That is the worst hot dog I've ever eaten. I, uh, gotta go. She's gonna go yak. She's <laughs> <laughs> I feel better now. Wait, don't come back and look where the hand is in there. Go back into the alley. No, go back into the alley. Oh. Can't touch those because of the thing. You may just be a mannequin. Ah! Did I just get killed? I thought you couldn't die. Isn't that, isn't that what happened to the, the the dude? Yeah. Hold on a second. What? Hold on a second. Can you tap to the other person? No, do one or two. I need to stay <gasps> focused and solve this murder so I can do what I need what, to uh, do. Is she dead? How do I? And on that note. Yeah, but how do I? Es I can't even escape right now. Hit space. You can't leave. No. Wait, look at your journal. Wait, is there? Look at. Hit the arrow. Bloodtron. It's just previous notes. Well, I. Go oh, into the it's alley. up here. It's up Go here. Into the oh my gosh. Load game. No, 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 don't load game. We're leaving. Yeah, right here. Look where she is. But we're leaving. No, I know, but we can go back before she dies, is what I'm saying. I know, but I don't know if she's dead. All right, well, at least we have the save we yeah. want. Next time. Next time on this episode of S Story Mode Saturday. No. Story Mode Saturdays. Correct. Yeah, Story Mode Saturdays. We will pick up where we left off and continue the great story of Officer Sort of Like Mulder and Officer Kind of Like Scully. I can't. Thanks everyone for joining us. Yes. You're all great.